guys, we are headed to the Bahamas today. We're gonna do a little bit of spear fishing, some diving, um, just kind of a fun day out there, just kind of a little bit of a change of scenery. Um, you know, that's the good thing about living on the east coast of Florida is we get to go cruise over the Bahamas whenever we want. It's about an hour and 30 minute drive there. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the Bahamas. All right, so we just got to the Bahamas here. I'm with my girl Summer. Get ready to go, suit it up. Hell yeah. I'm being a total Florida girl right now. I'm so cold and it's like a solid, like, I don't know, like 75 degrees right now. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's chilly though, it feels cold. It's windy, the wind's blowing. But check out this water. So beautiful. You can see the bottom. So excited, can't wait. So I'm a little bummed that I didn't get this on recording. However, me and Summer jumped into the water and as soon as we jumped into the water, the school of three blackjack just swam by and she told me, Kelly, shoot it, shoot it. So just, I dove down, took my shot and nailed it right in the head. Um, then I turned my GoPro on. So this is what I got of my first fish shot with a pole spear in the Bahamas. Didn't get the shot, but it was epic. And I'm happy I at least I got the fish. That was my dog head with no dogs. No in. shit. Yeah. Well, black yarn. Nice black. Get your hand out. Nope. <laughs> Don't fight me, bitch. Oh shit! Oh, grab, 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 grab. I didn't oh, get my hand in him. No. He got him. Okay. <laughs> Here, give me, give me a bucket. I don't have the second glove on either. That's my other problem. I was in the hole. <laughs> the, the head's like a mushroom, and I was underneath it, and I was swimming out. Nice. <laughs> I was swimming out, and he came around the corner to check me out. Oh, really? And just sat there, didn't even move. I was hesitating. I was waiting for him to turn, and eventually just let it fly. Is he like five? Yeah, he's a fat one. He's yeah, not he's very got long. Healthy like a motherfucker. Yeah. Question. 
so just to let you guys know that this was my first time ever using a pole spear, uh, spear fishing in the Bahamas. Um, I've used spear guns here and there back at home in Florida, but this was my first time ever using a spear pole. Um, and this video was recorded before I took my first free diving course. So I didn't really know all the tips and tricks in order to get down deeper and stay on the bottom and hunt. But I'm always thankful for those beginning experiences, especially with spearfishing, because now I can just go back and definitely get that redemption on that hogfish. Shot harder. Like yeah. Pull it down all the way as far as you can. Right in the middle. Okay. You got this. You bite. Do you have a, a flashlight, my champ? That's in the boat. Shoot. Okay. It's just my breath hold. If you get close yeah. enough, then here. If you don't get it, you don't get it. Okay. Do your breathe up. Get yourself to the bottom calmly. Yeah. Have your spear already pulled at the surface. Because when, when you see the fish and you know where the fish is, always have your spear pulled. It's one less thing to do. Mm -hmm. Lay on the surface. Look for it. snapper in there, really big snapper. Really? So if you think you want to try to just get to the bottom, forget about the hog, he's gone. Yeah. So just think, okay, I'm going to swim myself to the bottom, lay on the spear, get there. Don't even think about pulling your spear back, just get to the bottom and see it and come back up. See the button? Uh -oh. There's a massive button over here. Okay, cool. That button, he was just fucking booking it. Yeah. But he was like this. He was that big? Wow. He was big. Anyone, anyone, just hear me out. Hear me out for a second. Anyone think about it? 